Hello, everybody, and welcome to this session tonight. My name is Sarah Rose Stack. I'm the Director of Internet Sales and Training with MarketAmericanShop.com. And I'm excited tonight to be going over the MA Web Center opportunity. So with MarketAmericanShop.com, we have several different divisions, exclusive brands, products, and services that unfranchised owners can choose to specialize in. And the Web Center program is one of those divisions. It's one of those areas where you can make it somewhat of a business within the business. It's a nice professional service where you can go out and meet other um, traditional business owners in your town or in your area or people that you're connected with um, and plug them into our proven system to help them market themselves online. It's an incredible program um, where you can be successful right away. Um, there is substantial earning potential um, right now with regard to cash flow as well as for the future um, with, the, with the business plan, the compensation plan. So um, again, it's a very powerful opportunity and the purpose tonight is to go over what that opportunity is all about so that if you're evaluating this as um, a business venture for yourself, we want to answer some important questions that you probably have uh, so that you can make a nice educated decision about whether or not this would be a good fit for you. So the Web Center program, like I said, it provides a great system, um, and that system helps you to generate cash flow right away um, through our sales process, and it also helps you build a successful unfranchise. So what that simply means is that you have an opportunity to create cash flow and an income right away, and you have an opportunity to create ongoing income for the work that you've done with previous sales and other business building as well. Um, so when you when you sell through our system, there's a residual effect um, where clients produce ongoing business volume that can pay you additional money in the future as well, which is really, it's, it's a great program. You're building, you're building for now, you're building for the future. Now, if you're not familiar with what that on franchise business um, program is all about, then what you want to do is talk to the person that invited you to the session um, and, and ask to see the business plan so you can see the big picture because um, the retail profit is great. We're going to go through all of that. Um, but the ongoing income is even better uh, and it all fits really, really greatly together. So with that being said, it's the Web Center division, and so a lot of people, when you're looking at the different products and services that we offer, you look at the Web Center program and you set, you see that it's an online marketing strategy. It's a business, it's a business to business situation where, um, you know, you're doing business with other business owners and you're talking about digital marketing, and social media, and website management, and it feels highly technical. Um, however, what you might find is that um, even if you don't have a technology background or an, you know, a, a background in that industry, um, you might have the qualities that position you to be very successful with our program because uh, statistically, the most successful web center owners um, in, in the world actually have a, a subset of qualities in common. It's not their educational experience, their technical knowledge, or their, you know, um, their professional standing in the community. What it is is really a subset of qualities that position them to be successful. So people that have um, three or more of the, the following qualities tend to be the most successful web center owners if you're friendly and sociable because a big part of your part of the process is to talk to people and meet people and so your ability to connect with others is pretty critical for um, your success. Now when you first get started it may be a little bit clunky but you know over time you definitely can improve on any of these skills but you know if initially going into this you're already pretty friendly and sociable you're in a good position to be successful people that are well connected tend to do well as well because they just know a lot of prospects um, people that are go now so that just means a go-getter anybody that's a go-getter where if they um, you know are going to do anything they're the kind of person that's hundred percent all in or they're very committed they're people that are dedicated to their cause um, this is not a job this is something where you are your own boss and that means you need to be self-directed which means you need to be self-motivated so if you're the kind of person that you know like I said um, when you set a goal for yourself you are the kind of person that goes for it then again you're positioned to do really well right away 
professionals of all kinds tend to do well with our system as well. People that take their their selves seriously. And um, again, it's all kinds of professionals. So if you are a waitress and you take your industry extremely seriously and um, you're the best server there ever was because you do your job well, you have a chance to be really, really successful with our program. Again, it comes down to the quality of the person. And that has a lot to do, by the way, um, to the self-motivation part of it, right? You're in charge of your own schedule, you're in charge of your own process, and um, at the end of the day, you're going to make the income that's gonna be really correlated to the amount of work that you do. So if you're the kind of person that takes yourself seriously or takes your career seriously or takes your job seriously, then you'll probably take this seriously as well and you'll get some serious results. Um, young entrepreneurs tend to be really great with this. People that are organized and reliable or have management skills are also um, uh, really, really well positioned. Again, it all comes down to that self-direction. Um, and in general, if you are looking at the business and you consider yourself a good unfranchised prospect, um, you're self-driven, you are entrepreneurial spirited, you want to create additional streams of income for yourself, um, and you're motivated to do something new, um, you will have um, one step uh, forward and, and be positioned to do well. So, you know, I just wanted to take a moment to talk about that because I think that, again, with this particular product and service, um, people make the mistake of thinking, well, I don't have a technology background or I'm not a web designer. You know, am I really capable of doing well? And the answer is yes. The answer is absolutely yes. In fact, the top sellers in the entire company um, have these qualities and hardly any of them have um, industry uh, experience. So just keep that in mind. So again, tonight's the purpose of tonight's session is really to go through the program from soup to nuts and just evaluate everything that we're all about. Um, so that when you're looking at you know the decision at the end of the day that you need to make or you're thinking about the different questions that you want to have answered, um, you know, you have a nice big picture of what the program looks like. What does the process look like? Is this a product and service that you like? Is this a profitable business venture for yourself? Um, you know, the system, how does that system work? And can you picture yourself being a part of that system? Do you like that process? What kinds of support is available um, for yourself in your own process and also for your clients, right? At the clients that you bring on, what kind of support exists for them, and what are the different options that you have to, that you have to get started? So we really like these five um, areas and points of evaluation because we feel that in any business um, venture that you're going to consider for yourself, these are important questions to ask yourself um, and to find out, you know, if 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 it's a good fit. And so we want to answer these questions for you around the Web Center program. So we're going to start with actually the product and the market, right? So um, again, when you're evaluating a product and service, there are some important questions that you want to ask yourself. Number one, is there a market for the product and service that you're selling? Um, is that market over, overly saturated? Um, you know, is there a genuine need for the product and service that, that you would be promoting, right? Is this product and service one that you like? Um, and is it competitive in the market, right? So with that being said, I think we can all agree that there is a market, right? What we sell is an online marketing solution for small to medium-sized businesses. Every business owner needs a solution for website design and social media and Google and search engines and, you know, uh, Facebook. They all need solutions for these things. Um, and we know that not because we're, you, you're a marketing expert, but you know that because you are a consumer of the Internet. You are a consumer of the world. If, if you are doing business um, not only with big box companies, but also doing business locally, likely you're doing some business online or you're doing research online. Where do you get your news? Where do you socialize? Where are you researching your products and services locally? Um, where are you playing, getting music, books, periodicals, or even getting advice? Um, people today 
they get all of that stuff on the internet. They perform searches and they look for their products and services locally. They compare. They expect to be able to read reviews. They expect um, to be able to get up-to-date content. No longer is it acceptable for a website to have out-of-date um, content or prices or specials. If you go to a website and that content does not appear to be up-to-date, that affects your decision as a consumer. Right? We expect websites to be not only up to date, but also engaging. You expect to be able to do things on a website now, right? Even service providers have interactive experiences on their websites. Um, the internet connects the world. Everybody is plugged in um, at some point, right? And so you just have to think of yourself and the way that you personally consume the internet. And I think that the answer to the question, is there a market for this product and service, becomes quite simple. Um, because you know that there's a market because you participate in that market every single day. So we are a partnership, Market America, MA Web Centers, and you. And together what we do is we help small to medium-sized businesses, right? And so you want to think of the benefit of what our product can do. So there are technological benefits to our, to, uh, or features to our product. Um, you know, and at the end of the day, we're going to go through a couple of those features, but the most important part to understand are what are the benefits of our product. And the benefits are simple. We help small to medium-sized businesses to increase their revenues, to decrease their expenses, to increase their customer satisfaction, and ultimately we do those things by helping them to better market their business online. That is what we do. So what you want to think about is, um, you know, the difference between a feature and a benefit, right? The feature of a product or service is an attribute of that product or service. So, for example, if we were talking about a vitamin, a feature of the vitamin would be specific ingredients, right? But the benefits of that vitamin would be the benefits. So let's say it was, um, I don't know, like vitamin B. One of the benefits of vitamin, vitamin B could be more energy or it could be um, a decrease in migraines. It could be all kinds of things, right? So the feature is the ingredient, the benefit's the benefit. Well, the feature for our program, uh, the features for our program are the technology, the actual attributes of our system. The benefits of our program are increasing revenues, decreasing expenses, increasing customer satisfaction, and marketing your business in a more efficient and effective way. Um, the cool part is this. Um, I promised you that you didn't have to be technologically completely savvy to be able to talk to prospects. Well, when you're talking to your prospects, they are not web designers. They are not technical. They are not um, industry professionals either. They're small to medium-sized business owners. So they don't want to talk in terms of technology. They want to talk in terms of benefits. In fact, that's what all customers really want to do. They really could care less about the features. They really want to know what can this product or service do for me. And so all of us um, are more than capable of talking in terms of benefits because this is how we can help. And by the way, if you know how you can help somebody, you're more likely to actually talk to them about the solution that we have. So again, um, there's clearly a market for the product and um, the benefits are awesome. But in, in, in this day and age, the market, there's a lot of different options that business owners have, right? They can go through a discount hosting provider, which is really just, um, you know, those are great solutions for people that, hobby, that have hobbies. But, you know, if you go to any of our competitors, they have their their little hook, which is their advertising technique of saying, oh, you can get a website for $10 a month. Um, however, once you do that, they give you an entire um, laundry list of other things that you really need to consider having for yourself as a business owner because there's a difference between having a cheap website and having a business class solution, right? And so the, the problem is is that all of these companies that are selling their very cheap hosting to, to get you to reel in, you know, they're doing million dollar commercials and million dollar advertising efforts to hook these people and people invest time and then they say, oh, actually, you really need to be spending a couple hundred dollars a month to have a business class solution. So they kind of get tricked into these other solutions. And, you know, we're more transparent. We, we, we actually do things way differently. We want to give the business owner everything that they need. They, we want them to have flexibility. We want them to have um, uh, range in terms of marketing tools. We want it to be easy to use. We want them to feel supported. We want them to have everything they need 
to be at the forefront of marketing themselves online. And we want them to have all of that for one, um, for one monthly service fee. We don't want them to have to choose and, you know, what items they don't need or which ones they can't afford. We want this to be affordable for them. So we're not a discount hosting provider because we are transparent. We give them everything that they need right from the beginning. And um, we don't nickel and dime any of our clients. Um, traditional web developers, you know, they offer some really great pros and um, as well because, you know, technically or, or typically they tend to be really good at what they do. They tend to be talented designers and they tend to know what they're doing. However, they are also typically very expensive. And so, um, you know, while they might do a great job, um, they tend to be outside of the typical budget for a, um, a small to medium sized business. But more importantly than that, they typically tend to only do websites. And so, you know, again, today it's not enough to just have a website. You need to have a website as, and you need to have um, a way to market that website. Nobody cares if all you have is a website. If no one's going to it or it's not um, visible, then it's not really doing anything for you at all. Um, and so if you go through a traditional developer, uh, the problem that exists there is now you have a great website that you've, you've invested eight to $10,000 in, but nobody can find it. And so you have to go invest more time and more money and more resources into marketing that website, that very beautiful website. Um, so there's a lot of options that business owners have, and we recognize that. And we've got some really great um, uh, PDFs and really great videos and other sales resources um, that help to overcome the consumer confusion because what we have is different. What we have is an entire online marketing strategy. And so I want to give you a quick preview of what it looks like. First of all, we have a great solution for website development. Right? And so websites is not all that we do. Websites is just part of what we do, but we do it really well. We've got a solution for responsive websites. Um, responsive simply means that when a visitor um, goes to your website, it will automatically detect the type of device that it's being viewed on. So it will know, is this website being loaded on an iPhone, or is it being loaded on a desktop computer, or is it being lo loaded on um, you know, a Samsung Galaxy tab, or is it being loaded on a tablet or a phablet, right? It will know those things, and it will load the appropriate version of the website so that it can load quicker and have a better user experience. Um, so we have a free option for, for all of our clients to go responsive. Um, what's really great about that is just a few weeks ago, Google released um, a brand new algorithm which um, affects how um, businesses show up in the search engine. So very quickly, I think it's really important to address this. Um, Google is in the business of making good referrals. Right? So when you go to Google and you search for a specific product or service or term, Google's job is to return to you the most relevant results. And so in the, up until now, their main criteria for returning a very good relevant result was not just keywords, but it was content. Is your content good? Is your content um, in alignment with your keywords? Does this look like the best possible result? Because that's what they want. If they w Google wants you to keep coming back to them, which means they have to give you the information that you're looking for. So if they're returning good results to you, they know that, they're, that you're going to come back. Now, what Google has found is that the majority of searches are actually being performed on mobile devices. And so because of that, they've recently added a secondary, uh, second very highly weighted criteria to how they index websites. And that criteria was around the mobile experience. Because websites are being, um, or because searches are being performed on search engines on, um, on mobile devices, they want to return websites that have a mobile user experience. And so now it's, it's all about content that's still very, very critically important because that's ultimately you know, the business that they're in. But the user experience is important too. So if your website is not mobile friendly or if it's not responsive, um, then your, your, your 
statistics or your analytics probably went down in the past couple of weeks because Google is now saying, well, if it's being searched on a mobile device, then we are going to give priority to the websites that are mobile friendly. So a website doesn't need to be responsive in order to be um, mobile friendly. You can have a mobile version of the website. In fact, we have a mobile website builder just built right into our system as well. Um, however, it does need to be a mobile version of the site. All of our websites are completely customizable. We don't do templates. A template is something that is fixed, meaning you can swap out images or text, but the layout itself is, is generally uh, fixed to whatever that template is. Our websites can be completely manipulated um, to be whatever you want it to be. It also has an easy to edit drag and drop technology um, so that the business owner can have complete control. Simply put, um, like I said earlier, people expect content to be up to date. And so we need to make sure that the business owners have a reliable way to just log in and update prices or update specials or update their content without the need to hire a professional developer that understands coding or HTML5 or anything like that. Um, so our, our user experience for the business owners themselves is actually really, really great because it's, it's meant to be, if you can manage an email or surf the internet, you're capable of making changes to your website. So I want to show you how easy it is to actually make a change to your website so you can um, see it for yourself. Um, imagine if this was your company, Shoe Florist. Um, and you needed to go ahead and edit some text here, all you would do is log in, and then you would go ahead and hover over the area that you want to add the text. Go ahead and start typing away. You can see here there's a formatting palette above that pops up, and it emulates um, a formulating palette that you would use on an email system or you know Word or a word processing program. You can change color and bold and work with alignment. It's all very simple. When you're done, you click Save, and then your page is saved successfully. So you can see there, guys, it's really easy to edit content. If you can type out an email or if you've ever written, um, you know, in any kind of word processing document, you're capable of editing text on the website. Now, managing pictures or videos or other cool little feeds that we have is the same way. Um, it's all drag and drop technology, meaning you don't have to know any kind of coding. You just drag stuff where you want to go and you work within the different sections. So up here, uh, you would click add to page and then you would choose image and your image library would load. So what you see here are the images that are loaded into this library. So you can choose these images or you can choose to add an additional image to your library. It's just like adding an email attachment. So when you click on upload image, what happens is it asks you to browse your computer, choose the file that you want to add, and then it will pop it into your image library. At that point, it's ready to load and you can add it to your website. So to do that, what you do is you, you click on the image, you drag it where you want it to go, and you drop it, and then it shows up there. So you can see that it's actually really, really easy to do uh, exactly what you need to do. Um, anybody can do that. Working with videos or photo galleries or other um, widgets, like I said, is the exact same process. You click Add to Page, you, you choose the thing that you want to add, whether it's a form or a calendar or a video or a new slider, and you just click it, you drag it, you drop it, it's there. It's nice and easy to do. So you can see, if you own a restaurant or uh, if you own um, a business where you need to make edits, you can do this yourself. You have complete control over that. And, um, and not only that, but you can also dedicate your staff or your employees to help you manage your website as well. So no longer do you have to invest all this time into creating a beautiful website and then it becomes you know, outdated very quickly. It's easy to keep the website up to date so that your, your potential clients and your existing clients actually come back and use it. We also have got uh, a professional design center and they will do custom designs within those editable platforms. Um, managing content is really simple and really easy to do. However, um, most people like to have a custom design built for them from the beginning so that um, that design is branded to their business and they don't, you know, if there's any graphic treatment that needs to be done or any, you know, manipulating to the layout that needs to be done, they don't have to go through the process. Now, you can design something on your own using our tech support team. They're available 24 7 and they can help you for unlimited amounts of time or help your client. Um, but what we find is that the design center 
offers a lot of value because the process is just more enjoyable to have a professional team of designers working for you. For a very nominal fee, you can get a beautiful design that accurately represents the quality of your business. So you can see here that the designs are all completely different based on the needs, the industry, and the specific business or organization that has requested the design work to be done. This, this um, uh, not-for-profit has their calendar, their services, additional notification, important information, upcoming events, um, email sign-up, uh, ministries. They've got uh, all kinds of great stuff going on. This is an agricultural food fair, so you know their design is completely different, and it's it's meant to attract and interact with the people that are working with that particular organization. Um, this is a cute little design. Holy Shih Tzu, we love this one. Uh, totally adorable, and and clearly that th this business owner had a very specific genre in mind when they started their business. So we helped them to achieve that branding on their website. Um, which is the complete polar opposite of this um, cigar and whiskey company. Um, you can see that there's a very big difference. It's all about branding, and we want to make sure that your client gets the design um, that, that properly represents what they're all about. Um, whether it's e-commerce or whether it's a service provider or whether it's a restaurant, it doesn't matter. Um, the, the project managers will meet with your client, find out what their goals for their website are, uh, find out what they're into, what they're looking for, what are they looking to achieve with the website, and help them to develop that site right from the beginning so that now um, they have a beautiful website that's branded to them, and going forward, they can use the editor, log in, and make any changes that they want. Our e-commerce system is incredible. So um, if your clients want to sell online, they've got a, a wonderful e-commerce system built right into the platform. It's extremely flexible to use, meaning you don't need to um, be a, a professional developer to know how to work this e-commerce system. Um, but it's also incredibly dynamic, and that makes us very unique because most e-commerce systems are either dynamic or they're easy to use, but very rarely do you find one that is both. Um, you, most people have a dynamic solution where um, to manage their e-commerce platform, they have to actually hire somebody to do that. Um, so that they can provide a good shopping experience. Or they go with something that's easy to use because they don't maybe have the budget to hire somebody, but the shopping experience isn't great, and so the results are definitely not as great as the dynamic solution. Well, with MA Web Centers, we wanted to provide a dynamic solution that was easy to use, um, and we absolutely did that. Our e-commerce platform comes with a shopper wish list. Shoppers can leave product reviews. They can pan and zoom images. They can compare products. Um, they can reorder using the order history function. There's configurable products, multiple billing options. Your, your business owner can log in and they have a great, a beautiful sales dashboard where they can see who's shopping, what are the most viewed products, what are the most popular products, um, what was left in the cart. And there's all kinds of other really great um, tools that are built right into the platform so that your client can have a very successful online store. So I wanted to like give you a little uh, preview of what it looks like. The shopper account looks like this. So if you own, um, if you buy a website with MA Web Centers and you're going to sell online, your clients have a very professional experience. Um, you know, I'm sure you guys are familiar. If you've gone to a small business, sometimes their e-commerce um, process is a little bit uh, scary, right? Where you don't even feel comfortable to put your credit card into the checkout process. Well, with MA Web Centers, that's not the case. Um, all of our system is maintained by the way we have zero instances of any kind of security breach um, and our system is is in alignment with industry standards so shoppers feel comfortable to shop on your clients website um, shoppers can compare products so this particular person wanted to compare these four shirts um, and they what when they're ready to compare it shows them the different descriptions uh, the the main and the short description the SKUs, manufacturer color price and at the bottom here you can see and also at the top the shopper has the option to add it to their car add it to a wish list or um, they can just go ahead and remove it but they've got they've got really great options there when they've created, if they do create a wish list, um, it's really cool. They can actually share that wish list with people, um, or they can go back in and they can check out their wish list and go ahead and add any of these items to their cart. What I love about it is you can actually leave comments next to the items on your wish list as well. You can update it, you can add everything to your cart, or you can share it with somebody. So 
um, again, it's a really cool shopping experience for the, the customers of your, of your clients. In addition to all of this, um, I said this earlier, and we stand by this philosophy that having a website is just not enough anymore. Uh, today, that website needs to be marketed, and that website needs to be visible so that it can actually do something for your business, right? So you're not going to increase your revenues or increase your customer satisfaction if nobody can find your website. So all of our websites come with search engine optimization tools, social media tools, a customer relationship management system, an email marketing system, it comes with domain and emails, actually you get unlimited email accounts associated with your website, and mobile website design. You have the power of unlimited. Your clients can have unlimited pages on their website. They can create as many changes as they want. They can get as much traffic as they want, as many email addresses as they want, and they get unlimited upgrades to the system, and they get unlimited access to support making changes to their content um, and also managing all of those marketing tools that I just, that I just rolled off to you. So the power of, of unlimited here is really, really critical for a small business or a medium-sized business owner's success. Um, you know, most companies, if you add additional pages, it's not a one-time fee. It's a monthly additional fee. Um, if, you, if your website is performing well and gets a lot of traffic, um, they charge you for more bandwidth. With MA Web Centers, again, we just want to keep it simple. Um, we just want to, we want to be that little light at the end of the tunnel for the clients that are already overwhelmed with the myriad of places that they need to be um, and just keep it simple and just say look we're, we're, we're wicked transparent this is everything that you need and this is the this is the service fee that you're going to be paying it's not a big deal we also give unlimited upgrades so um, a couple of recent ones is we just we just launched new responsive layouts um, a few a few weeks ago and we're going to continue to add to these. We've also launched some new widgets, menus widgets, um, new social media, new sliders that came out, um, new upgrades to the e-commerce. All kinds of new widgets were coming out, little tools or applications. We also uh, launched a brand new email marketing system which is absolutely gorgeous. Um, and so if your client is email marketing to their customers like they should be, um, likely they're, they're subscribing to um, another provider like Constant Contact or Microsoft Dynamic or some other provider. Well, again, we talked about decreasing expenses. So we can decrease expenses because we provide those same kinds of tools to our clients for no additional fee. So not only are we incre helping to increase um, revenues and decrease expenses, but at the same time, we're also helping to streamline some business practices for your clients. Um, we're making that process simpler. We're giving them tools to help manage their business. Um, we've got award-winning customer care. Um, they are open 24/7, um, except for with the exception of a few select major holidays. Um, we have an ultra secure hosting facility. It's 24/7 surveillance and incident monitored. It's hosted on a tiered high performance Dell Power Edge servers. And we're buried in Nevada. Uh, they are protected from fire, floods, and earthquakes and power outages. We have a 99.9% .9 uptime, um, which is better than Facebook. And um, we have, again, zero instances of any security issues whatsoever. So, you know, we can boast about that because today there have been some pretty major companies that have had issues with all of these things. Um, and the only reason we're not 100% uptime is because we have scheduled downtimes when we perform upgrades for our clients. And we typically tend to schedule those um, during times in the middle of the evening where nobody would be using or accessing their administration. So in addition, um, we have a, an entire line of digital marketing and social media and design products. So our core solution is built around this idea that you know, a business owner needs a digital marketing solution. They need a way to market themselves. They need everything in one back-end office. And actually, that's probably one of the most um, attractive parts of our product and service to our clients is that they have everything they need in one back-end office. However, what we found is um, in the past uh, year or two, a lot of our clients were 
searching for services to be performed for them because they didn't have the time to manage their social media or their internet marketing strategy themselves. And so they were actually hiring outside um, and, and, and getting not really the results that they wanted to get. And so we actually launched an entire line of products around the categories of design, social media, and, in, and internet marketing. So for design, we've got design packages that are tiered really just based on the needs of the person, whether they just want a custom homepage built and they want to input the rest of the work, or whether they want 10 custom pages built and you know an e-commerce set up for them. Either way, we've got brand new uh, design packages that have just been released. Um, and in addition to um, designing the website, we've also taken a bigger approach to design and we in have included uh, mobile design or responsive design in that, as well as newsletter design. So if you um, buy a classic design package, if your client buys a, design, uh, a classic design package, they would not only be getting a website design, but they would also get a customized um, email layout for the email marketing system that they have with our website solution that is also based on the branding of the website. For social media, we have a social media management program where our team will actually post on behalf of your client's business um, every day, help respond to comments and manage the, the social media platforms of your client. Um, this is actually extremely popular uh, because most business owners know that they should be on Facebook or that they should be using Twitter or Instagram, um, but they're just not finding the time to do it. And so for a very nominal fee, they can pay to have that done for them on their behalf. We have an online reputation management program to scrub the web to make sure that there's no bad reviews that are popping up and, you know, to, you know, come up with a strategy to help bury any of them. We've got a Facebook advertising uh, program. If you want, you know, there's a difference between just logging into Facebook and boosting your post and spending money on, um, you know, sponsored ads blindly and knowing how to do that strategically. So that same $50 that you may spend on your own is probably not going to produce the same results that a professional spending that exact same $50 um, would get. And it just has to do with strategy and knowing how to set these up right so that you're reaching people that actually have the opportunity to do or the, the capability of doing business with you. For internet marketing, we've got some organic search engine optimization packages where we can help set your website up to perform well organically on the search engines. This has a lot to do with uh, keywords. It has a lot to do with the actual content of your website and um, making sure that everything is congruent. It's a one-time uh, setup. We also have Google advertising programs, which is probably our most popular of the new products. Um, almost all businesses today are investing some part of their marketing budget to Google AdWords. And again, just like with a Facebook program, of course you can just pay Google directly and try and do this on your own. However, um, you know, if you're going to invest a couple hundred dollars into Google AdWords, do you want to just spend a couple hundred dollars or do you want to have that couple of hundred dollars spent strategically so that you can get a bigger return on that investment? Our team of uh, trained uh, professionals and that are Google certified can take your, your monthly budget and stretch that budget out so that you get the biggest return possible. We also have a content writing program. If you don't want to write your own content, you can pay to have that done. What I love about that product is, and all of our products is that they're all done in house. Um, none of this is outsourced, so you don't have to worry about you know your content coming back written by somebody that you know is halfway around the world that you know doesn't quite understand uh, the vernacular or you know the way that the way that you would speak or communicate here. And that's true in all of our market countries. And lastly, we've got a new managed membership program. So we have a monthly service fee that all MA Web Center's clients pay, and then we also, uh, and that gives them everything that they need for a successful website and to market their website. It also gives them unlimited access to customer care. But like I said, not everybody has the time or wants to invest the time to make these changes or to implement these strategies themselves. They'd rather pay for that service to be done on their behalf. And so with the managed membership program, they can actually subscribe, um, pay a little bit extra money. It's not even a substantial amount of money. I think it's like 30 or 40 extra US dollars per month. Um, but they pay a little bit of extra money and that gives them up to 10 hours 
of labor or, or service to be performed on their behalf. So the difference is simple. You own a restaurant and you're an MA Web Center's client, you have a regular membership, you can call in a tech support and say, um, I need help updating my menu, this is what I have, can you walk me through how to do this? And someone will do that for you for as long as it takes. If you've got the managed membership program, um, and you own that same restaurant, what you would do is you would pick up the phone and call and say, here's my new menu, please update it. And they will actually do the update for you. You don't have to sit on the phone with anybody or you don't have to do anything. You just have to send them the new menu. So you can see here that there's a lot of great products. Um, we have an incredible product and service. The market is bigger than it's ever been before. The opportunity is bigger than it's ever been before. Um, and, and MA Web Centers is at the forefront making sure that we are providing exactly what they need and moving with the times, giving them the upgrades that they need to stay current, and also expanding our offerings to make sure that our clients have um, solutions for what they need with regard to their digital marketing solution. So with that being said, what I'd like to do is switch gears and take a look at the earning potential that you have. So as a web center owner, you would earn retail profit for all of the sales that you make, you would also earn business volume on all of the sales that you make, um, and that would pay that that contributes towards your ongoing income. And there's also other growth um, opportunities that exist within the program. So the first thing to keep in mind is that the average website sale is $12.99, and it generates about $1,000 in website retail profit for you. So what I mean that's very substantial income, right? So a, a one-time sale, you would sell it about $12.99. Most people add a design package on top of that, but you don't earn retail profit on that. Um, and you would generate about $1,000. So as, as a business owner, you can use that number in your own strategic planning, right? You can take your goals down and break them down into $1,000 increments and have a very clear estimate of about how many website sales you would need to make to achieve your goals, right? And so that's really great that you've got that statistic, you've got that average. So think about it. How, what kinds of goals you have for yourself? Can you create some sales quotas for yourself so that you have a target to work for? Um, pay for your travel expenses for the year, put your business in the black, help a, help a prospect to get started, do you want to go on a vacation, pay off some credit card debt, it doesn't matter. Whatever it is that's important to you, what you would simply do is determine how much money that costs and divide it by $1,000 and then that would give you a nice sales target or a sales quota that would really be self-imposed. So in traditional sales or outside sales or inside sales, a boss will give you a sales quota and they will say to you, you must sell this many things by the end of the month or you won't receive your bonus or you won't receive your commission or even worse, in some auto industries, we're actually going to deduct money out of your, your last check of the month because you didn't hit your sales quota. That's how traditional sales businesses work. Um, sales quotas are effective because it gives you a target. It helps keep you on track. Um, however, what's really great about our system is that any sales quota that you have is self-imposed and it's associated with something that's incredibly important to you. Uh, it's personal. It's associated with something that you have written down, you've given it a number, and you've identified this as something important that you want to pay for. So if you want to go on a vacation for $5,000, um, you would just simply divide that by $1,000, the average retail profit, and that gives you your target of five website sales to pay for your family vacation. It's a really great way to, to do your strategic planning. Now, in addition to that, remember every website that you sell has business volume that contributes to your ongoing income. So every website that you sell generates 230 BV initially for that initial sale, and then every month after that, um, every client would generate 30 BV per month that they remain an active client. In addition to that, the digital marketing products generate additional BV and retail profits. So I want to show you what they look like. The design products generate an additional 40 to 50 BV per sale depending on what they buy. Um, and depending on which one of the services they provide, they buy or which level of service they provide that they, that they uh, purchase for themselves, the social media products produce an additional 5 to 35 BV every single month per, per um, purchase. And in addition to that, they create ongoing retail profit for you as well. So if your client um, you know, purchases a Facebook program that would produce an additional um, BV every month, it would, it would also produce additional retail profits every month. And the same thing is true for your internet marketing. 
they produce on ongoing BV, anywhere from 24 to 100 BV, and it also produces ongoing retail profits, anywhere from 26 US dollars to 30 US dollars per month. Now what's really cool, and I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, is that our social media and internet marketing programs are available to all of our MA Web Center's clients and also available to non-MA Web Center's clients. So if you have a prospect that is not interested yet in having a full website redeveloped, that's fine. You can sell them a Facebook advertising program or sell them a content writing program. Whatever it is that their needs are, if we have a product that can help meet those needs, we can sell that to them individually, even if they're not ready to do a full website. So for you, what that means in terms of profitability is that a website client um, can generate a substantial amount of retail profit and business volume, not only at the initial point of sale, but also on a recurring basis for you, which is really great. Um, this is a very conservative um, uh, itemized list of something that a typical business owner might use or might need for their business. So the initial website sale would generate a thousand dollars for you and 230 BV plus 30 BV every single month, right? That's what the initial sale would generate. In addition to that, um, they probably would have purchased a design package. So you would have earned an additional 50 BV for that sale. Um, and then let's say that this business owner is going to um, do social media management, premium Facebook advertising, and the basic level entry of Google advertising. Because they chose to do those three additional services, now and not only are you earning a thousand forty-nine BV or, or dollars for the initial sale and three hundred and thirty-nine BV for the initial sale, but you're also earning forty-nine dollars every single month for that client and eighty-nine BV every single month for that client. So again, if you're not familiar with what BV is, I highly encourage you to talk to the person that invited you um, to find out what that means because the BV is where the big ongoing income comes into place. And so while you're doing this, yes, you're creating a substantial um, you can create a substantial income for yourself right away, um, but you have an opportunity to build a substantial ongoing income for yourself in the future as well. So in addition to uh, creating business volume and retail profit, the Web Center program also gives you a number of ways to help build your business overall. We've got uh, an internship program that you can offer to other people that would want to do the Web Center program with you. There's opportunities to build share of customer, both with MA Web Center's products and other relevant um, uh, shop.com or uh, brands. And we also have a global opportunity. So you have the opportunity to offer a competitive internship for up to four interns at any given time. Those interns will have unlimited access to our sales support team. We will help them to sell websites. Um, They'll conduct the sales appointments for your intern, sell the site, and help them get started. So it's a great way for you to expand the Web Center program in the long term. In addition, your clients are small business owners. So remember, um, the big picture, the main thing is the main thing, right? Um, you can, very, as, as a Web Center owner, you have to remember that you're also an internet entrepreneur, right? And so you, as a shop.com business owner who's focused and majoring um, in Web Centers, um, you're still an internet entrepreneur, right? And so all of your business owners have expenses. You can help them to save some money and also earn cash back by signing them up as a preferred customer on shop.com. In addition to that, you may find um, that there are some opportunities to build share a customer with other relevant exclusive brands and products and services, right? So for example, if you sold a website to a salon and um, that salon is you know, they do makeup or they do skincare or they do wedding makeup, you know, it might be a good opportunity to edify our exclusive um, cosmetics line, Motives by Lauren Reidinger, right? There's an opportunity to do that. And then finally, small business owners are entrepreneurs. So they make excellent unfranchised business prospects as well. And we have a system in place to teach you how to actually properly network with these people. And in addition to that, your web center is global. You can sell in any of our market country, uh, or countries or our emerging market countries. So is this a profitable opportunity? Absolutely. There's high retail profit. There's residual business volume. There's opportunity to duplicate the program. You can build share of customer in a, in a myriad of different ways. And there's also opportunity to expand globally. 
So you've already established we've got an incredible product. It's profitable investment for your client, right? It's going to help your client in a big way. There's also a solid earning and growth potential for you, the web center owner. So what I want to share with you next is what does the system look like? Before I do that, I want to mention that we have a standardized educational program. We've got a Web Center Training 101 and 201 class, and those classes cover more in detail what our system for sales is. The 101 class is a more simple class meant to get you started, and the 201 class has some more advanced networking and sales strategies. But what I want to share with you right now is the fundamental building blocks that make up our sales system. So the first thing to understand is what you're selling. So you have to ask yourself, what are you selling? Are you selling websites, marketing tools, digital solutions, social media, Facebook, or both or all or none of the above? And the answer is actually none of those things. You sell an appointment, right? You are not selling technology. You're, you're not talking to web developers. You're talking to small business owners. And most biz, small business owners are extremely busy. And so when you're talking with them, you don't have time and neither do they to go into the details of any part of our solution. And so it's important that you focus on selling an appointment where you can actually dedicate time to have that done properly. So it's really simple actually. Our system is built on you talking to your prospects and selling appointments and then leveraging a, a, a selection of teams to handle all of the heavy lifting for you on your behalf. And what that basically means is you set an appointment and we have a team of professionally ta uh, trained product specialists. They are trained on our solution. They are trained in, in sales. They are trained in what's going on in the market. And they actually conduct the sales appointments for you. So you don't have to be fluent in what our product is about. You don't have to answer questions. You don't have to worry about any objections because the product specialist will handle that for you. From there, we've got special teams, whether that's a design center or an SEO team or a social media team. If a design center package or one of our new social media or digital marketing packages were purchased, the special teams will help to integrate that part of the service. They actually provide the service. You're not, you don't have to worry about designing the website. You don't have to worry about integrating any of these services that you've sold. Our special teams will handle that for you. And then from there, we've got a dedicated customer care team. It's home country support. It's 24-7. And they handle all of the technical follow-up for your client. So it's important to understand what your role is, right? Your role is to set this chain of events into motion and, uh, and leverage the teams appropriate, appropriately. Allow the product specialist to conduct that appointment for you. By the way, they will read your notes when you schedule the appointment. And they will chat with you before the appointment happens. So if you have any you know, important hot buttons or information that can help the product specialist close the sale for you, you can talk to that product specialist before the appointment is supposed to happen. They will demonstrate the technology to your client. They will answer your prospect's questions. They will handle the follow-up. They will sell the website for you. The design center um, does the designing for you. So a project manager is assigned to your client and will handle all of the communication for you. They will handle making sure the design is, is uh, designed the way they want it, that it's integrated, that it's launched. They handle the entire process for you. You don't even have to be a part of it. The customer care team, again, they're there to handle all of the heavy lifting and all the technical support going forward. Your job is simple. Your job is here. You schedule an appointment with the website prospect and the product specialist, and you allow the teams to do their job. Um, at that point, the, the special teams take over. So how does it work? Well, the first thing you need to do is actually think about the business owners that you already know. Where are some of the places that you currently spend your money? That's a really great place to start. So for example, if you go out to eat at any kinds of restaurants on any, on any frequent basis, or not even on a frequent basis, but if you've been to a restaurant, then it's really simple. Write their name down, Google them, and just take a look. Do they have a website? Does it look any good? Um, does it look like they're using social media? Does the menu look up to date? Um, you know, and could this be a good potential prospect? I always find that spending 30 seconds to Google my prospects is a really great thing to do because it motivates me to pick up the phone and call them and try to talk to them. Um, because I know that I can help. Now, I always use that information very strategically. I don't call my prospects up and tell them why their website is horrible. I call my website uh, prospects up, and I use that information to form some really great questions 
and get them to tell me that their website isn't doing what it should be doing. So here's the example. I pick up the phone and I say, hey, Joanne, it's Sarah Rose. How are you? Listen, I'm a huge fan of your restaurant. In fact, we come here every Sunday. And I was trying to share your website with a friend, but I couldn't find it. Do you guys have a website? And a lot of times the, the person on the phone will say, actually, um, we do have a website. And I'll say, oh, wow, I couldn't find it on Google. Um, what's the address? Is the menu up to date? Oh, really? It's not? Oh, well, that's too bad. Well, listen. Now, here's the point where um, you have to edify the teams of professionals. This is the point where you actually are going to try and sell the appointment. right? You found a couple of things that are important. You, you found out that they do have a website, but they couldn't be found. You've asked some questions. Oh, it looks like their menu isn't quite up to date. Looks like um, you know that's why they're not marketing their website right now. right? So you would just simply set an appointment. Now, if you're first getting started with the Web Center program, you're probably and you're and you don't have an industry professional background then what you want to do is do what most web center owners do and opt to use a, what we call a referral approach it's a simple sales approach and it's this idea that you're making a referral um, and you're edifying our team and you're not claiming to be a specialist because you're not one yet and that's okay so you would say something like you know Joanne listen I work with a great company that has an entire division that specializes in helping businesses like yours um, look, if you'd like, I could get you an appointment with one of their product specialists to see if they may be able to help you out with that. Uh, it sounds like you guys have, you know, you really need to get going with correcting, you know, your website and getting it up to date and helping people to find it. I'd love to help you. Love your restaurant. What typically works best for you mornings or afternoons? And so it's that simple. Um, it should feel natural. It should feel organic. You're simply making a referral. You're offering a solution to a problem that they have already admitted to you on the phone, and you're just selling an appointment. If they have any questions um, that are technical, your answer is simple. Listen, I don't specialize, but I work with this. You know, the the people that I'm going to hook you up with are going to be able to answer all of your questions. They're really great. They've actually helped tens of thousands of businesses already. They've been in business for 15 years. They're an excellent company. Um, and I highly recommend them. Uh, also, it helps to end in what typically works for you mornings or afternoons because at that, it's just psychological. You're not saying, hey, uh, do you want an appointment? But you're saying, when can we do this? Um, so it's a really great way to get them to commit to a time. So again, I want to remind you that we have standardized training. Uh, we have a 101 and a 201 class, a simple and an advanced class. And they cover more in-depth goal setting and strategic planning, the product, the marketplace. We do some really great market comparisons and product comparisons in these classes. We talk more in detail about how to generate leads and how to expand your leads, how to talk to your website prospects, how to leverage our sales system, how to expand your business with your web center, um, uh, recruiting techniques and how can you actually use the physical web center that you have to help market your web center business. So with that being said, in order to sell website appointments, you actually need a web center. Um, so what comes with a web center? Well, all web centers include a front end website to actually help market your website sales business. So what we like about that is, you know, we recognize that web centers is B2B or business to business and you need to have a separate website for that. So it's not integrated into your shop.com site or into any of your other websites. It's a separate website to help market your web center business. And that web center has an interactive sales calendar, which is what you would log in and use to schedule appointments to trigger an appointment with one of our dedicated product specialists. You also have access to domains, emails, and email marketing. So you can have professional emails set up for yourself to market your web center business. You also get access to a lot of the marketing tools that your clients have access to. So you have access to a customer relationship management system, search engine tools, social media tools, mobile websites, and more. Um, you also get free upgrades as well, but most importantly, you have access to people. You have an entire team of sales uh, professionals, designers, um, SEO specialists, e-commerce specialists, a billing department. Uh, social media specialists, Google specialists, um, and customer care teams that all essentially work for you. It's a business in a box. You can get started literally this week and already start scheduling appointments, already start selling websites within a week by simply leveraging our teams of professionals because regardless of the technical knowledge or the industry experience that you have or don't have, our team does have that experience. We've got, again, um, over 15 years of experience and, and still growing and still expanding. 
Web Center owners, yourself, um, you also have dedicated online resources. You have got a distributor support site, mawc411.com. You've got a, uh, a webinar series that has ongoing online education, online training. We've got a Facebook uh, support group for accountability. We've got a blog, blog.mawc411.com forward slash blog. You've got a YouTube channel dedicated to housing some training videos. So if there's not a live training in your area, you have an opportunity to still be trained. We are actually in the process of redeveloping even more of our um, Web Center owner support uh, resources from our Getting Started Guide, who are our 90-day Fast Track Guide, um, um, and our website, all of that is being uh, constantly updated and, and redeveloped so that it's always showing you the most uh, current and, and useful uh, information possible. You also have unlimited access to tech support. Um, you can access them uh, via email, phone, fax, or even via a live chat support. They're available 24-7. And there's a myriad of brochures, product cards, product pages, flash drives, and videos. All of that is available on our mawc411.com site and in the admin of your web center. So to get started, you've got a couple of options if you're ready to get started. If you're an existing um, unfranchised owner, then your option to become a web center owner is you can purchase a web center or you can purchase a web center reactivation. A reactivation would be uh, purchased if you've owned a web center in the past um, and maybe you've let it go and you'd like to get started again. So the different codes um, are up there, but again, you know, it's if you're an existing unfranchised owner and you want to get started, this is how you would go about that. Now, if you're not an unfranchised owner yet and you're looking to start your unfranchise specializing in the Web Center program, then we recommend that you get started with the MA Web Center's Fast Start Kit. So it's $3.99 to get started. Um, and then you get your master on franchise business, so you get 300 BV and three business development centers. You also get an independent on franchise owner sub, sub kit, business building materials, and you get your MA Web Center, which comes with all of those things we talked back, talked about before. But most importantly, that that is backed by the MA Web Center's teams of professionals. So you get that entire business in the box. It essentially comes with employees to uh, in, to do your sales, to implement your services that you've sold, your products that you've sold, um, and to help you have a successful business right away. So let's go ahead and just re-ask those questions. Um, the product and service, is this one that is a good product and service? Absolutely. It's all inclusive. It's a superior online marketing strategy. It's a business class strategy that is second to none. We help businesses leverage the internet and market their business in the most effective and, and also the most affordable way that's out there today. Um, is this a profitable business venture for yourself? Totally. It's a substantial retail profits that can be earned right away. There's business volume to help you earn an ongoing income in the future. And there's also opportunities for you to build your business in depth, both domestically and also globally. Um, what is the system like? The simple is, the system is simple. It's a proven system more than that. And it's again, it's supported by teams of professionals. So your job is very clear. Your job is to be the liaison. You are the one that goes out and meets the prospects and vets the prospects and sets the appointments. And then you turn it over to the teams of professionals to integrate and, and to handle all of the heavy lifting from there. What about support? There's standardized trainings available, webinars, meetups, printed materials, and again, teams professionals that not only support you, but also support your clients. And there are multiple options to get started. Uh, you can purchase a Web Center Fast Start Kit, you can purchase a Web Center as an existing unfranchise owner, or if you just want to give this a trial run, you can also participate in the internship program. So you want to talk to the person that invited you to check this out if you're not an unfranchise owner yet, Get your question answered and decide what is the path that you want to go down. What is the best um, way for you to get started that fits um, that fits with your with your agenda? So remember, all of the knowledge in the world is completely useless unless you take action. Um, thank you for joining us tonight. What I what I encourage everybody to do is to check out mawc411.com. You know, take a look at some of the webinars that have been uploaded. Talk to the person that invited you. Get your questions answered. Um, if there's a Web Center certification training happening in your area, even if you're not a Web Center owner yet, I highly recommend you go to one. Take a look and you'll get a beautiful picture of what the process looks like, a nice in-depth overview of everything that we're all about. 
um, and just get started. Do something to start your journey for success. So I want to thank everybody for joining us today. Um, again, I encourage you to get your questions answered um, and take the next step. Thanks a lot, guys.